What's going on everybody? It is Wild Willy and my voice just kind of cut out when I went to hit that high note, but that is all right. It happens to everybody. So we are back out on Bush Rangers Run and I believe this is our fifth mission we're working on. Yeah, fifth. Yeah. All right. Fifth mission. So for this mission, we have got to harvest a feral goat fleeing with a single shot of the 223 so we got our 223 ar loaded up of course no need for a bolt action we're just going to start lighting up a group of feral goats and hopefully hopefully we can get one that's fleeing what i should really do is check hold on yep got all of my water bottles we're still bringing the tripod stand just in case because i never know what the next mission is going to be i kind of got a feeling it's gonna be something I don't want so they give us a good mission of oh hey go out start shooting some feral goats and then we'll give you a little hey go spot some fur ha <laughs> yeah thank you guys so much for that but hey anyways we are going to be heading out and looking for a group I'm hoping there's a group right on the other side of this hill but hey we're not gonna sit here and blah blah blah, 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 blah for hours on end i know I, I could i really could to be honest i really could i'm not gonna lie as you guys can tell here we go with the blabble and on and on and on and on again so i don't know if you guys really like me blabble and on and on and on and on again and again and again and again so yeah all right well i guess that's just me so who knows who knows so we're out here bush rangers run climbing up a big old rock i kind of want to peek over this hill before we kind of take a break right there and there's one right there look at that look at just like that we're on goats a single goat what all right this is not what I signed up for I signed up for a herd oh does he spot me I don't think it spots me where's the herd a lone barrel goat what are the odds of this fellas I want to get the spotting on him there he is he's right there he's right there all right so what we got to do is we got double tap we got to miss. We got to get right on target and put one right in him. All right. Where is he at? There you are. All right, he's coming in. He's coming in closer. Hey, the closer, the better. The closer, the better. It gives us more chances to shoot him. Bah! Oh, it's even a male. Woo, doggy. That's what I'm talking about. Bah! Right back at you, fella. Right back at you. Really young one. Really young one. All right, here we go. That's a miss. All right, that should be one hit. That should be one hit. I, I think we hit him twice. He should go down. It looks like an intestine hit. Go on. Fall down. Fall. Usually I'd just be wop, 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 wop. More rounds. Oh, he dived right there. It looks like he fell. At least his nose went down. Come on, please tell me you want to hit that feller once. Huh! Where did he go? Is he dead? I don't see any white patches. I can't believe that started off just like that! With one goat! I was hoping for a group. Drop one and then just light them all up as they run off. Alright, well it looks like we got some tracking. We do have some tracking to do. Huh, it looked like a solid intestine stomach area hit. I was expecting him to go down fairly quick. Oh, we got turds! Can't start a hunt without collecting our turd samples. Alright, one hit intestine. Please don't be a body hit right here. He, nope, okay, intestine. Alright, we're good. He's down right there. Down right there. We see him. He did not go far at all. Wait. He's not dead. Come on. God, I just... I want to shoot him again. I really do. I'm itching. I'm really itching. I can see the bullet hole. We hit stomach intestine area, so it's it's a, it's a kill shot. Some people are like, nah, you should shoot him again. He didn't drop. No, no, no. Intestine, stomach are definitely kill shots for... Ah, there he goes. For a lot of animals. For a lot of animals. 
All right, I already lost where I was at because we just did a circle. But he's down right there. He didn't go far at all. Oh, right there. There was another one. Get him! I don't know. He might have went out of render. He was up there. I don't know if we got him. We'll go and investigate. We'll explore over in that region. But hey, hey, more turds. Nice. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't think we got him. I don't think we got him, boys. Girls. I don't know if I have any girl viewers, but hey, you gotta say it. Alright, he's down. He's down. We got one down. We plah! Another shot. I don't know what that was. It made sense in my head when it went plah! But now that I'm saying it, it really doesn't make any sense. Alright, anyways, anyways. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? One bullet, one bullet, one bullet. Yes! One bullet in the test end, just like we said. 77.5. And that is another mission complete. So, before I go all gung-ho on these feral goats, I want to make sure I didn't hit this one real quick. Where? I don't know. That shot felt really nice. Unless the tree deflected my bullet. I, I don't really have a lot of problem shooting through these bushes. So I don't see why it would. But you never know. You never know with the hunter. I'm not going to lie. Because, I mean, I could try to shoot a bow through this and it would hit the tree. Right here. Right through this opening. Right here. There could be a feral goat way up there. No, wait. Where's the better? Right there. There will be one right there and it will stick right here in this tree. You just never know. Oh, I see bunnies. Look at that. I see him. Then another thing I have problems with, too, is the rocks not loading in. 200 meters out, the rocks will not load in. Only thing around that is you can't get the spotting on one. So that's a good thing to remember too. I did it. I do it on Fox quite a bit. Hey, we hit him. We got another intestine hit. Nice. Nice. I have no idea where this thing went. They really need to put jumping in this game. They really do. I can hear all the bunnies roaming. All right, where'd this one go? Fleeing. This way. Do you leave? Oh, he better not have left this border. I'm going to be upset. We placa him. Bang. All right. All right. So the other one didn't go super far, but this one doesn't seem to be bleeding as much. So maybe it wasn't a clear path through. Pass through. That was another goat call. But I don't want to unclick this goat. Alright, what the heck? Another male. Up this way. But this one. Alright, this one's gotta be somewhere. Oh my goodness, dude, there's so much turds. He's right here. Nope, another track. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, looks like he went to meet up with his buddies. I'm not going to lie, that's a smart play. Blend in with the other herd. But you're hurting, dude. You're hurting. Can't hide from me forever. I, th I really hope I'm still on the right goat. I thought for sure this thing would be dead by now. Alright, so we caught back up to a few of them. I'm not seeing my wounded one. There's a white one. There's a brown one. I don't see any dead... Oh, look, there's a bunch. Look at them. They're stacked thick right there. Yeah, I'm not seeing the one that uh we shot. What the heck? Oh, what the heck? All right, we're going to have fun. First you... Oh, I'm out of bullets! No! Stop! Please don't run! Stop running! No! Oh my goodness, Wild Willy out here making airs! Alright, so I don't see... 
my wounded one at all. I don't see anything down over here. Alright, that's another two hit. I think I hit one in the foot. Not gonna lie. The other one I think I hit in shoulder blade. I looked a little far forward. Oh, man. The struggles of goat hunting with a 2-2-3. Two, two, oh, well. We'll find him. We'll get on him. We'll get back on him. I think there was a matter of 2-4 right there. Yeah, I think 4. But I don't know where my other one went. We're right here on the border, so I'm really surprised I could even shoot. We're past the border, actually. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, we know one is hit good. One will go down. But the other one, I think we hit it in the in the foot. I mean, not just the foot, like the ankle. But hey, it should go down. It's bleeding. It'll bleed out unless it clots. Unless it gets a blood clot, then it stops bleeding a lot. But then it should start. I'm just going to stop right there. But anyways, let's see if we got any... Barrel goats down right on the other side of these railroad tracks and over top of this little ridge. If not, we're going to start putting putting shots down range. I really got to be careful. I don't want to use up all my ammo just in case the next one is another 223 mission. What are those? Oh, there they are. Double tap. Triple tapped, I think. Oh, there, is that my black one? Hey, come back here. Is that, I don't think that's my black one. That one can't be my black one. Let me reload. I got one bullet left. This is bad. All right, so I see one dead. So what? There were three right there. What is that? That looks like something right there. I have no idea. No idea. No, no idea. All right, so I got one down right there. The problem I'm having is finding these things after I shoot them. Hey, we got one right here. Hey, nice. Wait, isn't this the one that we shot in the foot? Yeah, left hind laid. Then we got a body shot. Nice. This one's dead too. Two. All right. All right, so let's try to find the white one. The white one should have been the first one I found. I don't know why that one didn't die. Where did you go, my friend? All right, this one should be somewhere over here. All right, well, I'm going to start trying to find these things, so bear with me. We still have one more mission to go, so I'm going to hurry up and check that out after we locate all of these feral goats. All right, here's that last one we just shot that we double tap. We shot it in the intestine. Then we get only hit it in the front leg. Not bad, not bad. Another one down. There's another one laying down up here. Is that my mystery one? No, that's... That is the other one that we triple tapped. Nice. I still have on that white one. Is that it right there? That is it right there. Look at that. It's right there. Bet it up. Man. If it wasn't for all this thick stuff, you'd never have seen him. All right, let's pick up this one. I think we triple tapped this one with the 223. I could be wrong. I might be wrong, and I'm probably wrong. Yeah, we double tapped two body hits, taking it down. Took it downtown, just like that. There's our other white one right here. I would like to see if that other black one is the one that we initially hit in the intestines. I don't think it is. Two body hits take it down. I'm sure a vital intestine hit will take it down. But hey, I'm I, man, I keep seeing things, but every time I look through my binoculars, you can't see it because the vegetation comes in. Like this one. If I didn't stay up on top of the hill and if it wasn't white, I would never have found this feral goat right here. That black one is... That one would be tricky to find. Tricky, tricky. So we've lost one so far. Hey, that's all right. So here's our next one right here. You can't even see it. You can only see its butt. So we only got a body hit on that. Like I said, I thought for sure my shot was a little far forward. But before I check out the other mission, I'm going to peek over top of this hill real quick and see what is over this hill because we know I think we had lost one over this hill. Once we kill this one, that's a whole group down just like that. We're almost out of bullets. So let's go ahead and make our way over top of this little ridge right here and take a look all right well we're back at the lodge we're loading up our 243 
one bullet at a time, apparently, because I guess the 243 is not a bolt action. I thought it was a mag fed bolt action gun, but I'm over it. There's nothing over top of that ridge. I came up, I looked down, spotted all around. I didn't find anything. And we got piggies calling in the background, but we're not after pigs. We're after feral goats. And our next mission for feral goats, there's good and bad news. The good news is, is we successfully did the next mission. The bad news is, uh, we're going after feral goats with a recurve bow. Have to shoot a male and a female. The bad, bad news, we really, we don't even have the appropriate camel for this place. We're out here in our ball camo. Only thing I have comparison to it. So Wild Willie went ahead and invested in some feed for his feeder. Yes, I could go and put a tree stand or a tower blind right there and shoot him at 30 meters all day. Not have any problems. But I kind of want to do the old fashioned spot and stalk even if they are on my feeder. At least just get one of these things done and over with. We've killed a lot of feral goats already in the video we have been talking a lot in the video a little bit different to be honest rather than just like cut scening it all the time we were actually talking and I was having fun I'm still having fun we're gonna get one first I'm probably gonna take out my uh, tracer arrows and see we'll do a little target practice here what is he at all right I know we gotta be at like 30 meters I think but trying to spot and stalk these animals these feral goats is really hard. It's it's you gotta play it like football, where you gotta like all right. Let's say you're a linebacker for football. The guy's taking it around the outside. You have to beat him to that point. You have to know angles. Yes, we can do it, but the problem is they move fast, slow, fast, slow, and they don't walk a straight line. No animal really walks a straight line. Like, come on, let's be real. They're out here trying to survive just like we are trying to hunt them. So, it, it's going to be difficult. But if they're on a feeder, if they're congregated in one area, it gives us an advantage. We still have to stalk them. It's, you know, it's still fun. we got to stalk them, get into a good position where we can execute a kill shot. But at the same time, we can get spotted. We can get too close and not realize it because, look, you can't see. You can't see when you're climbing through this stuff. So that's, it's going to stink. So either way, it's fair. 50-50 chance. Maybe we'll try a spot in stock. We probably will try a spot in stock because I'd like to get two missions done. So let's go ahead and continue on with the hunt and see if we can't get a kill on this feeder. I don't even know if the feeder's active. I literally just put it in like half an hour ago. So we're going to see. I know as soon as feed hits it, I'm pretty sure they come or are somewhat around that area and attracted to it, but we'll know or more information when we do our surveillance from the top of this hill. So, with that being in your minds, now that you guys are processing this whole thing, I hopefully you guys can understand where I'm coming from. You know, you're you're I'm a hunter. I want every advantage I can get to successfully harvest this animal with a good integrity and a good what would be the other word? Good, good more no morals maybe morals more no I don't know but I I'm a hunter I want that prey so I'm gonna take every opportunity I get to get on that prey and get a successful kill and feed my fat face with some food so let's go ahead and continue on we're almost to the hill now so it'll only be like a couple second break because I can't stop talking today and look at that. Here we go, we're on. Oh, he is right there. Holy guacamole. He's really close. Where is he? All right, we'll know more here in a second. So give me two seconds. Bah, out. All right, look at that. We got one go on this feeder, which will make our life so much easier. That was another thing I meant to say. Everyone's like, oh, you're just going to crawl to the feeder. Yes, but if there are 20 goats on a feeder and they're roaming all over the place, you know how difficult that is not to get spooked? Yes, you get more opportunities to shoot at them. But when there's 30 of them, 20 of them all over the place, you don't get to pick and choose. 
Where this time I've got one goat, one goat to concentrate on, one goat to worry about. So this this could actually help us out here. So we're gonna try to close the distance. Like I said, we gotta be at least 30 meters. 30 meters with no camo. Oh shoot, I didn't even bring wind indicators. I don't even know if I'm coming at this thing with wind and scent blowing right at this thing. No idea, you guys. So this could get pretty interesting. So, with that being said, our tracers are loaded because it'll make it a lot easier in the video to see rather than just shooting a uh, dark figured arrow at a dark animal. You guys will actually get to see the tracer in the animal if we get lucky enough to shoot it. So, I'm just angling towards our feeder right now because he worked in. That was actually the one that called from on top of this hill. So, he was working his way down this hill. And from the time we got that call... So when we started recording, that's how much ground he covered. How much ground can we cover crouch or crawling towards these animals? That's, now now pieces are coming together. The puzzle's getting complete. Hopefully you guys see what I'm talking about. They are difficult to hunt because you basically have to crawl to them. And you can see how fast they move. They only stop like this for a little bit of time. I think he stopped like this for longer because it is a feeding area. So let's try to close the distance and keep on crawling. Oh my goodness, it could happen right here, you guys. Could happen. It really could. Oh, he's at 35. It just happened. Oh my goodness, we just stuck him. We just stuck him. I don't know where, but he's hit. He is hit. Oh my goodness, we just stuck him. It looks like we hit a little low. Oh my goodness, we're going to give this thing some time. He's already slowing down. 35 meters. We finally got it done, you guys. We're going to keep an eye on him. Kind of looks like maybe, maybe just like a leg hit. But he is right there. I can see the arrow sticking out of him. It was a clean pass through. It looks a little low. But he's hurting. He's hurting bad. So we're going to keep our eyes on him. Oh my goodness. My heart is pounding right now and I don't know why. That is a male. Oh, look at the tracer arrow. It looks like we... I don't know where we hit. I have no idea. I'm guessing it's a body hit, you guys. So we're going to go ahead and hang tight and watch this thing closely, and hopefully he goes down. Oh, he just bet it up. He's down. He's down right there. He just went down. No freaking way. What are you? No. You know, I haven't used this gun in a while. We're going to test it. We're using it. Where are you? Where are you at, you little hooligan? Dunzo like Rapunzo! Alright, another one down. Alright guys, here he is. A long-awaited goat is down right here. Let's go ahead and pick him up. Yep, we got a strictly body shot at 33.9 meters. He's not a giant. Not a giant by any means. Holy guacamole, do we shoot far forward or what? But you know what, you guys? It is a trophy. We got it done with a recurve. That is, that's awesome. That's awesome, you guys. Let's try to get a nice trophy shot. Oh, we did it backwards. Gotta do it this way. All right, so hold on. All right, there it is. That's a pretty cool trophy shot. I like all the white in this one. His ears, his eyes, his mouth. It looks like he's got white lipstick on. You can see we did shoot pretty far forward, but hey, I'm all right with that. We got it done with that goat. I couldn't be more happy. Now we have to go grab this kangaroo really quick. All right, here's our kangaroo. He's down. Down. It looks like a nice long hit. Yeah, yeah, a nice long 73.9. Not a giant kangaroo, but not bad. So, unfortunately, this episode, we only got one mission done. We killed a lot of goats, though, and we got a kangaroo. That's not bad, but we got set up for our next bow hunt. I personally think that's going to be an awesome tree stand set up or a tripod stand up. Just 
it just feels like you're in the Africa. You're in a, the smallest group of trees around that area sitting on their food source or their watering hole. At least that's how I'm looking at it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. We have got a female feral goat action with the recurve coming at you guys next time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. I kind of figured we were going to have to do something with the recurve. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Tell me what you guys thought. Are you guys still enjoying this? What missions do you want to see next? I kind of made a list. I made a list. I'm thinking like the Parker bow, the grizzly bear, or the wolf. One of those. Somewhere's like that. I have most of the other ones pretty much done except for the newer ones. So like I said, you guys, let me know what you guys want to see. So until next time, you guys, hunt safe, shoot straight, and we'll see you guys out there.